All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So the characters that are going to be featured in the upcoming Dual Dokkan Fest for this year's download, or sorry, uh, Worldwide Campaign Celebration. Man, what was wrong with Download Celebration? It was fine. I was used to it, you know, 200 million, 250 million, 300 million, should have been 350 million downloads this year. But instead, they decided to change it up on us and call it the Worldwide Campaign. I mean, I guess it makes sense. It's Global versus JP. But why? You know, like, there was no need to change it. Anyways, the characters for this upcoming Dual Dokkan Fest for the Worldwide Campaign, um, they're pretty much confirmed at this point. I mean, not 100% confirmed because... There's no official news, obviously, from Bandai or Akatsuki yet, but it's it's essentially confirmed. And the reason I say that is because recently it was discovered that the Tokan events for the three-year Int LR Vegito as well as Wuhan are both going away at the same time on August 26th, okay? And usually when this happens for events, it means that new stages are going to be added soon. And when it happens for Dokkan events, it means that new stages are being added because a new Dokkan Fest unit that requires the new medals are going to be added to the game, are, are coming out soon. So, I mean, since yesterday, we pretty much knew that ALR Super Vegito was going to be one half of this dual Dokkan Fest. And, uh, you know, a lot of people were pretty upset about that, but we'll talk about that later. <laughs> and the question that was up in the air was, what was the other half going to be? What was the you know, other side of this dual Dokkan Fest. And now that we know that both Dokkan events are going away at the same time, right before the, uh, you know, download celebration part one is set to start, we're going to be getting an LR Buhan as the other side of this, uh, you know, dual Dokkan Fest. So there you go, guys. Very, very likely, not 100%, just to be clear, once again, not confirmed, but very, very likely a LR Super Vegito and LR Buhan Dual Dokkan Fest is on the way for both Global and JP for this year's. I mean, I was going to say this year's download celebration, but I guess the first worldwide campaign. So uh, there you go, man. I want to hear in the comments down below what you guys think about this. I know yesterday there was a lot of negative reactions to the Super Vegito news. Um, personally, I wasn't that upset. I mean, in the video, I said it made sense from a business perspective, and I think some people saw that as me saying like, oh, it, it's good because it's good for business, and that's not necessarily what I was saying. I was just saying in the video that I, I knew that it was going to be a Super Vegito because it made sense business-wise, right? But at the same time, I was also pretty stoked still. I was still pretty hyped, all right? Honestly, like, it's still a Vegito. I still got a lot of love for Vegito, even though I'm a Gogeta fanboy. I, I've always said... Uh, Vegito is like right there, you know, like it's pretty close, even though Gogeta above Vegito a little bit. Okay, anyways, I'm getting off topic. Uh, I'm happy it's a Vegito mainly because I love Vegito, man. And even though we have had quite a few Vegitos and fusions just in general recently, I'm, I'm still going to be excited when a new Vegito comes out. I know he's going to be insane. I know he's going he's gonna to look awesome. And uh, I'm stoked, man. I'm going to summon. I'll be honest. So I'm not that upset about it. And for this LR Buhan, I'm happy, man, because I've been wanting an LR Buhan for quite some time now. Um, Boo, honestly, is just overall one of my favorite villains. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if he's my favorite, but he's definitely up there too, right? I really like Boo. Um, so you know, I'm excited for that too. Uh, can't wait to see these animations, can't wait to see the details. I'm sure both of them are going to be very, very busted. I'm going to assume that Vegito is going to be the better of the two, but I'm sure both of them will be very, very good. So uh, yeah, I'm overall quite optimistic about this, but I want to hear your opinions once again. Let me know in the comments down below if you're excited or disappointed that we're most likely going to be getting a Vegito and Buhan Dual Dokkan Fest. Um, if you guys have predictions about potential leader skills, like new categories, or potential passives, uh, maybe even typings, and all that stuff, feel free to let me know about that as well. I would love to uh, read your, you know, ideas, and 
Uh, one other thing, so aside from this Dual Dokkan Fest kind of confirmation thing, we're also going to be getting a new stage for Boss Rush, since uh, that's also going away too. But that's not really a surprise because we, we usually get you know new Boss Rush stages around this time, right? So uh, Boss Rush level 11 should be on the way. Uh, should be another 35 stones. Maybe they'll bump it up to 40 this time. Who knows? You know, it's been a while since we've had 35 stones per level. So maybe this one will, will give 40. I don't know, but either way, it's going to be a good amount of stones. Uh, should be coming to both Global and JP, I think. It should be. It should be. Anyways, uh, new boss rush. And then, uh, you know, Wuhan basically confirmed. Vegito confirmed yesterday, but even more so confirmed now that the event is uh, going away. New stage going to be added. And that is pretty much the video, guys. Not much else to say. We haven't really learned anything else, but... Um, I guess that's some pretty big news because it people have, people have been speculating, right? So I don't think there's really any need to speculate anymore unless there is a really big twist that happens or, you know, they were just like trying to throw us off with like the event going away, you know, to trick us, which they don't really do. So <laughs> I think it's pretty much confirmed. I'm pretty confident in the Buhan Vegito thing, but like I said, it's not 100%. So there's always that small chance that, you know, we could get something different. But uh, there you go, guys. That is today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys are excited for the download. Damn it. Mm, no, Worldwide Campaign. Why did they call it Worldwide Campaign? Why couldn't they just keep the download celebration thing? It was okay, man. Like, I was so used to calling it the download celebration. And now every single time I have to, like, correct myself in my mind when, I, when I'm trying to say download celebration I have to say worldwide campaign or maybe I should just keep calling it download celebration I don't know what do you guys think let me know in the comments down below are you going to continue calling it the, calling it the download celebration or are you going to cave and call it the new name the worldwide campaign which in my opinion is just much more much less exciting it just sounds boring I mean it's the same thing really but it just it doesn't sound as hype I, I gotta say it doesn't sound as hype Okay, anyways, it's late. I'm getting off topic. I need to go to sleep. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, as always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.